I refer the Minister to a recent paper published in the Journal of Health Economics, which is, suggests that electronic nicotine delivery systems, i.e. vapes, and the adoption of recreational cannabis laws are both associated with the reduction in adult cigarette smoking and may indeed generate tobacco-related health benefits. And I ask, one, what are the latest available smoking figures for WA and have they, as suggested in previous years, shown a, sl a slowdown in the number of WA residents quitting tobacco? And two, will the Department of Health consider this latest research when it next reviews its approach to tobacco harm reduction? One, the prevalence of current smokers aged over 18 years in Western Australia in 2021 was 9.9%. .9%. Prevalence of current WA sm smokers aged over 18 years has declined from 21.8% in 2002 to 10.4% in 2020. The annual prevalence estimates of current smoking for WA adults aged over 18 years continues to decline. Two, the Department of Health considers and reviews evidence-based approaches to reduce the harm caused by tobacco use and exposure to secondhand smoke, aligned with the WA Health Promotion Strategic Framework 2022-26 and the Australian National Tobacco Strategy 2023-2030.